Hey, what's up everyone? So today I'm back with another video of the restaurant review series where I go to restaurants and review the food that they serve. And um, if you haven't heard of it yet, I've made a playlist for you guys to check out in the card above and the description below as well. And uh, subscribe for the upcoming videos. So today I'm here at the Classic Rock Coffee, which is a new restaurant with the rock theme. And I've got to say, they've done a pretty good job designing this place, but it's not all about the design it's about the food. I've noticed that they have vegetarian meals marked in their menus so that's a plus if you're into that and let's go and see what they have in store for us. Okay, so today we are ordering two plates. First one is the tacos. Um, I've talked to their manager and he showed me how the tacos are made. And he said, and showed me as well, that uh, the bread, they make it here freshly every day. And you guys know I'm all about fresh food. So I'm pretty sure it's gonna be awesome. When I heard it was fresh, this caught my attention. And uh, they have two types of tacos. They have the crispy tacos and the soft tacos. And they also have beef and chicken, so we ordered uh, two crispy, two soft, two beef, and two chicken. And they also have uh, three types of sauces, the sour cream, the salsa, and the guacamole. So let's dig in. Okay, so we're gonna try the sour cream with it. Not gonna put too much. Oh boy. The crispy one is so crunchy. The beef, it's soft, it's good. It's not hard and chewy. The spices are good. It's a bit spicy, but not too much, which is good. Like you don't need to drink water with it. Oh boy, this tastes ridiculously good. It's awesome. Let's try the salsa with it. So good. Just diving in these tacos. I mean, with tacos, you gotta get messy. You gotta get your hands in. Definitely the best tacos I've ever tried. The beef is so good. The bread is so freshly made. The crunchiness, amazing. Okay, so now we're gonna try the soft tacos with the chicken. Oh, I can feel the softness. This feels so amazing. Like when I saw the chef who was making these, I was so excited to try it. So good. It looks so good. Let's dig in. Oh boy. It's 
so far. This is the number one tacos I've ever tasted in here. Amazing. And I do prefer the soft one over the crispy ones. The chicken, if you guys can see, it looks so tender. So good. Oh boy. <clears throat> Uh, this one is definitely, I want to eat way more of these. So I've gathered my thoughts. For me personally, I like the soft tacos because they don't make as much mess. But if you like crunchiness, I would definitely recommend the crispy tacos because they taste, they both taste amazing. Um, and chicken or beef, it depends on your preference, but both were good. I like the beef more. So basically soft tacos and beef tacos for me were the best. But it depends on you, it depends on your preference, but we ca you can not go wrong with any of these combinations because they all taste amazing. See, like with these crunchy tacos, it makes a lot of mess. So for me, I don't like to get that much mess in my food, but the, the taste was so good. Oh, and by the way, the manager told me not only these tacos, uh, bread is made here freshly. All of their breads like nachos and the next meal I'm going to show you, it's all made in here. So it's definitely fresh. Okay, so now let's try the last one. Um, these tacos are a bit spicy, I can say. I usually don't like spices in my food. Mexican food is usually most all of it spicy, but the spices in these tacos are not that much high. Like, you can tolerate the heat. See, that's why I like the soft one better. It's because I took so such a huge bite and did not make a mess. All right, last bite. Boom. So now for the second meal, um, we have the paninos. What are the paninos? Well, the paninos, they are grilled sandwiches. Um, they have butter, bacon, and they have it in uh, chicken, beef, veggies, and also in salmon. As I said, they contain bacon, but it's turkey bacon. And um, why did I order these paninos? Well, the bread here is made every single day. So it's always fresh. It's, uh, regardless of it's being made by them, it's always going to be fresh. This is a plus point for them. It comes with a side, either a side salad or fries, wedgie fries. Um, I ordered the fries because I like fries. Anyways, the most important thing for me in every single sandwich and especially grilled sandwich is cheese. And this contains so much amount of cheese. It contains cheddar cheese and it contains mozzarella cheese. All right, let's try this one.
I can see it's a bit fluffy and also crispy at the same time. Just perfect. Okay, so now let's try it. Okay. I like the crunchiness of the bread. It's also soft from the inside. I can taste the chicken. Mm. The bacon tastes so good. Oh boy. Let's try the sauce. Oh boy. The sauce just flips it around. So good. It looks like a bit of mayo, but sour mayo. I like mayo a lot. So good. Let's try the wedges. Crunchy. Not too hard. Good spices. I like these. They're good. The atmosphere was good since we entered this place. The music is calm and it's not bothering anyone. The place is big and well air conditioned. So I'd easily imagine getting here, getting work done and editing, doing all the things that I need to do and without being bothered easily. I love the atmosphere, it was so good. So I'd give it a solid 10 out of 10. So now moving on to service. The service was pretty good. Everyone was really friendly and helpful. They helped us a lot and it was a seamless experience. So I'd give it a 10 out of 10 as well. I really love the service and everyone who works here was really friendly. So yeah, thank you guys. The food tasted amazing. It was the best tacos that I've ever tasted. And I definitely recommend the soft tacos. I'm definitely coming back for these. And uh, the only complaint that I had was with the paninos. The bread was slightly dry, but it wasn't too dry. Like the crispiness and the softness inside were amazing. I really liked it, but it was just a little bit more dry. But that's fine for me, so I would give it a 9 out of 10. And finally, let's talk about prices. Well, prices, the price is not too high and it's not even too low, so it's like a bit between average. I wouldn't say it's cheap, but I wouldn't also say it's expensive. It's definitely same as any other cafe or like a place that you would go to. Um, so like, like usually the average, and the prices would get 8 out of 10 for me. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you found it useful, make sure to tell me that by liking this video and please subscribe because I'm working on so many more videos for you guys to watch. And I have one last request from you guys. I want you guys to share this video with at least just one friend. Even if it's just one friend or two, I wouldn't mind. I just need you guys to share this love. And yeah, thank you guys. Peace.